Good morning, dear students. Today we are going to learn a new lesson. So we are going to talk about robot progress and grammar reported questions. Are you ready? Here we go. Hello and welcome to the world of robotics. From here on out, we will be exploring the field of robotics. And by the end of it, master the basic concepts, skills and techniques required to build your very own unique robot. But before we start, it is important to know what a robot is first. Here is a simple question, which of the following do you think are robots? Did you select the following? If you did, congratulations! Only these are what we considered as robots. The others aren't. What exactly is a robot? The term robot comes from a Czech word, robota, which means forced labor. The word robot first appeared in 1921 in a play, Rosam's Universal Robots by Czech writer Karol Kapik. The definition of a robot has changed over time. In the past, a robot was just a clever mechanical device. The robots we have today are more advanced and sophisticated. Until today, there is no standard definition for a robot. But we can refer to Major Materic's definition to help us understand what is and what is not a robot. Or in other words, a robot is a machine that can sense, think and act to achieve a goal. It gathers information about its environment and uses that information to follow instructions to do work. Nowadays, robots are becoming more and more important because they can perform many tasks for us. Unlike human workers, robots do not get tired, sick or sleepy. Robots also do not get bored doing the same thing over and over again. They can perform high precision tasks with speed and accuracy. And most important of all, robots can carry out dangerous tasks and work in environments where humans cannot, for example underwater or in outer space. Now that you have a better idea on what a robot is, are you ready to build your own robot? Let's get started. Well, I guess I forgot to mention that we will have to start from the basics first. And to do that, we will be using the Riru robotics system. Whenever we learn something, we always have to learn from the basics, right? And with a good understanding of the basic skills and concepts, it won't be long before you become a master robot maker. And thus, for real this time, let's get started. Reported questions. Reported questions are one form of reported speech. Direct question. She said, are you cold? Reported question. She asked me if I was cold. Direct question. He said, where's my pen? Reported question. He asked where his pen was. We usually introduce reported questions with the verb ask. He asked me, if whether. Yes, no questions. He asked me, why, when, where, what, how? Question word questions. As with reported statements, we may need to change pronouns and tense back shift as well as time and place in reported questions. But we also need to change the word order. After we report a question, it is no longer a question and in writing there is no question mark. The word order is like that of a normal statement, subject, verb, object. Reported yes, no questions. We introduce reported yes, no questions with ask plus if. Direct question. She said, do you like coffee? Reported question. She asked, if I liked coffee. Note that in the above example, the reported question has no auxiliary do. But there is pronoun change and backshift. Note that we sometimes use whether instead of if. The meaning is the same. Whether is a little more formal and more
or usual in writing. They asked us if we wanted lunch. They asked us whether we wanted lunch. Reported question word questions. We introduce reported question word questions with ask plus question word. Direct question. He said where do you live? Reported question. He asked me where I lived. Note that in the above example the reported question has no auxiliary do. But there is pronoun change and backshift. Reported statements. Simple present. I always drink coffee, she said. Simple past. She said that she always drank coffee. Present continuous. I'm reading a book, he explained it. Past continuous. He explained it that he was reading a book. Simple past. I broke the glass, he admitted. Past perfect. He admitted that he had broken the glass. Present perfect. I have been to Spain, he told me. Past perfect. He told me that he had been to Spain. Now it's time to do some examples in the reported questions by yourself. 1. Simon, do you want to drive? 2. Susan, when do you arrive? 3. Mark, had John left? 4. Sean, where does Petra live? 5. Jake, did you watch the match? 6. Monica, can I help you? Good.